when I consider the theme of this year's budget, I notice building resilience for inclusive green recovery. Sarah follows Emerson's quotation that nothing great was ever achieved without enthusiasm, it's just art. To the theme of this budget. Friday, November 26, 2021. We mark the last day for the debate for Seca Salon budget for the year 2022. The leader for the Coalition for Change, c 4 Party at the Salon Parliament, Honorable Sir Emerson Lamina, take the floor of the well of Parliament for debate just as other MP them from different political party them been done do. And although Honorable Lamina been talk on plenty issue them inside in debate for Seca the 2021 budget, it been lay more emphasis on three main areas them we get to do with local government tourism and the mining sector inside local government honorable lamina talk about how government for give more strength to local council them for able to generate more revenue when a couple with them for use for bring development na them area them this according to honorable lamina now because the local council act of 2004 don't all and not the see one side with plenty other law them and this is in a big challenge for the local council Counsel them. Mr. Speaker, all members, it will be a far cry if they ask, the very act that is almost now obsolete, the Local Government Act of 2004, if it is not synergized with other acts such as the Mines and Minerals Act, Lands Act, Agricultural Act, it will be a very far cry for local councils to generate all such revenue, which they can use at their own behest, Mr. Speaker. Other than that, there is need for a tripartite governance in this country. Central governance, I'm representing now, local governance, and chief of governance. There is need for a synergy for us to realize the very one that we say, I to have said chief of governance, local governance, and this central governance. There's a great need that is what we call the local council has enough and a huge potential. A total age is romance with a million time development plan. It will definitely work well. Mr. Speaker, I can quote offhand Section 45 of the Local Government Act of 2004, Section 56, Section 69 to 72, all talks of revenue mobilization. We're going to surprise you that agreements today from multinational mining companies will not mind. It's very hard. Sometimes I begin to doubt. Is the hard senior or the agreement senior? Honorable Sir Emerson Lamina carry on for point out more issue them inside the local council act of 2004. One of them now we is it not clear inside the act as to waiting at the role of the deputy mayor, deputy chief administrator and plenty other position them inside the local council. We make it think say government for look inside this act and upgrade them for solve them plenty issue them here. Up to now you have not distinguished the role of the mayor and the deputy mayor. In the act, so big, with lots of partners, until now, you have not distinguished the role of a CA and deputy CA. You have not distinguished the role of a chairman and a deputy chairman. In the act, see how big it is. Which act surfaces before the very policy of the that act we begin to get problems? Mr. Africa, I remember, besides finance officer, engineer, procurement officer, development officer, all other positions, you have to find them in the act. There is need to review that particular act. At the tourism sector, the C4C leader call on the Ministry of Tourism for go work on a Kono district and look at different touristic attractions them where he thinks they will help boost salon tourism potential as Honorable Lamina outlined different area them in Kono district where he say go find for tourism. Why are we applaud the Minister of Tourism? for the brilliant move in identifying certain localities for our touristic ventures I also gently beckon to the Minister of Tourism of the potentials that Colon as a district has also. Mr. Speaker, a few things come down to Colon and see a few touristic centers which I believe will beef up the economy. If only it's all utilized. Properly, number one, Sangangewa. There is a place called 
there are in the whole mountain that sits across the land kingdom against the kingdom and the salon kingdom. Up that mountain, you will notice a new drop, Sangan Dewa. Come down to Sangan Dewa. Yeah, it's very close to Palawan. And see, Sangan Dewa. A new drop, on the top of that drop, there is a lake. And one can send a stone, and you hear the drumming. They own a utopia of that particular rock. That is it. That touristic center can be utilized. Come down to Corona. And also, it's utilized. Come down to Corona. Also, it's utilized the river Bagbet and Bafi. Bagbet, by the way, is white river. And Bafi is black river. You will notice the wonders of God. Two rivers meeting. With a three separation, black and white, no mixing point. That's a fine tourist center. It is found on Constituency 027 in Sando, where Honorable Bendu Superintendent. On the area of the mining sector, Honorable Sir Emerson Lamina talk about the need for giving more strength to the mining law them, like the new Mines and Minerals Act and the National Minerals Agency Act, within now at the table of parliament. Mr. Speaker, I remember page 143. Talk of strengthening the legal framework. The legal framework for mining. What does it mean? We are privileged about a week or two ago, the mines, the new mines and minerals act and the NMA act were laid on the table. The new act. And if it is utilized, at the end of the day, it is passed, ratified through this parliament, who notice the huge job that is in that act, Mr. Speaker. Money has potential to turn around our economy. Mr. Speaker. Ten percent. Ten percent free is what this ministry will benefit from and the country at large. Ten percent free carry. Which means whenever the shareholders of the Maramba mine share their dividends, so we are not government, we are saying ten percent free. And it also surprised on top in October. The Maramba mines paid ten million dollars. To the government, and in December also, we receive around ten million dollars to the government. So we notice how the money has the potential to turn around. I tell you. As the Eri, Honorable Sir Emerson Lamina, talk about how the new mining law them with the now in a parliament go help for benefit the mining sector and the country as a whole. More so, we parliament get for don't grieve for them for become law for Saloon Parliament. I on Glad TV online. Mina Abdullah Bla the reports.